We are going to continue on with lock flow. So this is lock flow number three. So just a recap of what we covered the past couple of weeks. Rowel punches, gunting, elbow smash, open up the hand, counterclockwise, wrist lock, turn it, right hand goes over, counterclockwise, wrist lock, and then lock flow three is the Z-lock, where I grab the last three fingers of his hand, I collapse his elbow, I squeeze together, and I fold in, and he should snap. Okay, so from this angle, he punches, gun team, elbow smash, open up the hand, counterclockwise, all right? Wrist, um, wrist lock, swim over, clockwise wrist lock, I grab these last three fingers with my hand, take my left hand, bend his elbow, and then I'm going to squeeze his elbow and his hand together, forming a Z, and I'm going to fold it and roll it forward. All right, so from here, I'm going to squeeze and roll forward. All right, so how to counter that third um, block? So if Raul does that to me, one, two, and three. So if I don't do anything and he squeezes and he rolls forward, all right, that's the Z lock. So there's uh, this is one variation of how to get rid of that um, this lock and get this off of me. So I'm gonna pop my wrist forward and then straighten my arm out at the same time. So I'm gonna use my left hand to pop my wrist forward and my arm releases. All right, and I'm out of the lock. So from this angle here again, he does that to me here. Lock one. Lock two, lock three, all right? So again, if he squeezes and he rolls forward, that's a lock, all right? So I wanna take my left hand, pop my wrist going forward, and straighten out my elbow at the same time. So as he rolls forward, I pop and I straighten out, and I'm really to disengage, so I can either run or re-engage with the foot. All right, so that's lock flow three, that's it, and then I'll see you next week.